couple of gallons in it because uh, if you don't pay enough attention. So, so prepping is, you know, these folks have been canning, uh, putting away, hanging onions, uh, storing potatoes, uh, preserving meat. You know, prepping is, is uh, uh, that was done here back in the 1800s because uh, you know, that, that's just how life was back here. Gotcha. All right, is there anything else you guys want to add? I think you guys are great. Well, thank you. I, uh, I sure don't. I appreciate your time and uh, been been fun talking with you. And maybe you can move here in, in the real United States. And <laughs> I, I've kind of come to the resolution that everything west of the Rockies and east of the Mississippi is, is kind of like a different nation. I'm not really sure what's going on in those places. Uh, th this seems to be grassroots here and good, sincere, honest folks. Awesome. Well, thank you guys all so much. It was a pleasure to meet you guys. Thank you, ma'am. Honored to talk all to right. you. Take care, guys. Well, Jules, Jules, and got Jules and Seabass up next. These are these are they, they're both employees, and they are unique. You don't want to let the employees. Okay. Here we go. Hi. Hi, Stephanie. How are you? I'm okay. How are you? Good. Okay, tell me your name. Sorry. My name is Jules. My name's Steven. We call him Sea Bass. And you guys work at the shop? Yeah, we work here at the pawn shop. I'm a mechanic for him down here. Got it. And what do you do? I guess you could call me a GF. I'm a general flunky. I do anything I'm told to do. I love it. So how long have you been working at the shop with you guys? I've only been here in, in Waldron for a year. I'm from Louisiana. Uh, all right. 